Hello and welcome to the 360 Payments training video on how to register with TransLink, which is the online reporting website tied to your 360 Payments TransFirst account. The first step will be accessing our website, which can be reached at www.360payments.com. As you can see here, I already have the website pulled up. Once on the website, you're going to want to look at the top right section for a tab that says online reporting. Hovering over that will provide a few more choices. For today's purposes, we want to select the top item, online reporting. Now that we're on the page for online reporting, keep an eye out for the chance first online reporting. That can be found right here. Transfirst dash translink. The green button is what you'll want to click, and it's letting you know that if you truly do have a Transfirst account, your merchant ID number will begin with either 543 or 413. Let's go ahead and select that option. This now takes us to the Transfirst Translink online reporting website. You're here to register. Go ahead and select the tab at the top that says register. I'm going to go ahead and clear out my data so that we can review how to register for an account with TransLink. Before you can get started, you'll want to make sure that you have the two necessary pieces of information. And those two pieces are the top field and the bottom field. The top field, merchant ID, will be the first piece needs to be entered. Your merchant ID is your unique account number tied to your account with 360 payments and TransFirst. If you need this number and you're not aware of it, you can get this number by calling our office or by viewing your monthly merchant statement. One other way to locate your merchant ID would be to look at the sticker affixed to the side of your credit card equipment if you do have physical credit card equipment at the business. The other piece of data that you'll need before you can proceed with registering is one of the three pieces listed in this bottom field, DDA slash SS number slash tax ID. You don't need all three of these items, but you simply need one, and this is for security purposes. If you select DDA, that is the bank account that we have on file for depositing credit card funds into. If you select SS number, you'll need to enter the social security number of the individual who signed the application with 360 payments. And tax ID will be the tax ID on file for your business. Please keep in mind that this field is all numerical. So if there are spaces in the bank account, you need not submit those. And when it comes to the social security number and tax ID, please leave out the dashes or hyphens and simply write the numbers. If you do have those two pieces of information, you are good to go ahead and register today. So you'll enter in the merchant ID number. You'll select a password. Please keep in mind the left margin over here will let you know what the password requirements are in case you're having any trouble. Next, you'll enter in your email address. This is an important field because the email address that you enter here will be used should you ever forget your password. That is where the temporary password will be sent to. Below that, you'll simply need to verify the email address you entered above to ensure there are no errors. And then lastly is that step we spoke about, which is the security measure. So you'll simply select which option you want. Let's say, for example, social security number. And then you'll enter in that number here. Again, all numerical. No spaces or dashes, please. Once you have all that information, then you'll go ahead and select register, and the system will let you know if the register was successful or not. From there, you're good to go ahead and log in and start using your online reporting. And that does conclude our training today on how to register for an account with TransLink to view your 360 payments transfers online reporting. We hope this was helpful. If you have any questions, please reach out to our customer service team at 408-295-8360. Thank you so much for tuning in, and we hope you have a great day.